This is Team TV. You are now tuned in with the section. Nigga, I, when we moved, when I moved, my family moved out of Rialto and moved to Fontana. That's how I met Face Nim. You know what I'm saying? In 95. You know what I'm saying? That's how I met them. I was best friends with his big brother, Terrell. So I used to go to their house every day, nigga, then. After school, spend the night, stay with them, all that, you feel me? Then they moved. Then they moved to the block. You know what I'm saying? So when they moved over here, nigga, it's like, damn, nigga, y'all not, not neighbors no more. We, nigga, I used to walk from Fontana to this motherfucker. Nigga, or I go on the way, I might see me a bike, or I prefer the beach cruiser. I hold, I hold the wagon on me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But the fat nigga, you know what I'm saying, got to the block. But when I got to the block, though, I was on some, I'm tired of niggas asking me where I'm from. Plus, you got half the homies wanted to bang, pot room, half the homies we wanted to push crap. So, I had to get in the middle and be like, nigga, fuck all the nigga. I'm not nigga neither, because I'm not picking no sides. Turn all the rags in, turn them black, nigga. We ride for one of them. If you ain't really from them hoods, nigga, Especially when I got back from the pen and knowing what they doing the floss flaggers. What they doing the floss flaggers in the pen. I, I couldn't wait to tell the home, hey man, y'all better stop claiming that shit. <laughs> Nigga, you know, they got they been telling you gonna be doing booty scoops. <laughs> okay, you know, the ass packed with knives. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Scrape the ass with that ant ass, nigga, on, on the yard. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know, like, nigga, I was telling you I ain't gonna put no name, but a couple of, a couple of niggas went through that little ringer. And they're claiming the wrong shit, nigga. They, nigga, they, they, they come, come here, girl. Yeah. Once you hear that kid, uh, nigga, they, <laughs> they finna get at you. What was your, uh, what was your upcoming like? You had both of your parents and shit growing up or what? Nah, nah, nah. I, I, uh, I was raised by my grandparents. Okay. But my mom was always there, you know what I'm saying? When she was, you know what I'm saying? She grew up, we grew up like brother and sister, though. Right. Oh, your mom was mom young was when she had you? My mom was 14 when she had me. Oh, okay, yeah. You know what I'm saying? She she running around this motherfucker, extra out every day still, you know, young, living it, you know, doing what she do. Right. My pops, you know what I'm saying? He in and out the pen, nigga, you know what I'm saying? He 20-something years in the pen. Right. You know what I'm saying? He free now, you feel me, doing his thing. You know what I'm saying? Out there in Vey Vey, in that Vegas. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So. You got you got uh, siblings? You got brothers and sisters and shit? I got, uh... I got a brother and a sister with on my mom's side, and I got a sister. I got two sisters on my dad's side. They older than you or younger I'm than you? I'm the oldest out of both, oh. both clans. Oh, okay, okay. Well, in both clans, I'm the oldest. <laughs> I'm the fattest of the fattest on both sides. <laughs> and a nigga tell you, to, don't never do nothing that you ain't never seen a nigga telling you to do something do. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't seen a nigga blow a nigga head off, don't let that nigga tell you to blow their head off. A lot of these uh, newer G homies, was, which was busters. They were busters, you feel me? When they was coming up, they wasn't really doing that. They was just here for a long time. So the ones under them is looking at them as big homie. When they, they, they acting like they big homie, but the whole time, they wouldn't, they wouldn't, they were pieces of shit when they was coming in. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, they wasn't nobody. So it was like a, the blind leading the blind at that point. And that's what it is. A lot of floss flagging ass, weenie ass big homies. Is telling these kids the wrong shit, nigga. When they not telling them respect, what, what made them? Like, my for example, if I'm looking up to a big homie, and I love this, and I know this nigga flawless. He nigga ain't got no smut on his name, nothing, everything right. And a nigga walk up I'm like, oh, this bitch ass nigga, whoop whoop whoop. If I don't get off on him, at least I could do is like, hey, big homie, this nigga woofing. Don't just let him say this shit and do this shit when you know that's foul because a nigga calling you big homie. Because a lot of big homies wouldn't even check the bitch shit niggas is doing because they getting called big homie. You know what I'm saying? They thinking that shit cool because they say if I, if I check him, he might not call me big homie no more. And I love this shit. Nigga, I want to stay big homie forever. <laughs> so that's how they is right What you feel about the snitch code? You feel like it's changing today or do you feel like niggas is still sticking to I the code? I feel like niggas what? don't, a lot of these young niggas don't know what snitching is. A lot of these cats, they'll try to, a lot of people will destroy, try to destroy real niggas behind saying they telling, but the whole time, nigga, the nigga that they eating that noodle with is telling with them. All them telling. You know what I'm saying? So, there's man. You, know, you got Tiny Mafia, Jackson Babies, Yellow Boy Mafia. Niggas on real bad. fuckery north. Niggas on real fuckery north. See, niggas, oh, niggas sleep on that. <laughs> Jackson, Willow, 
baseline. If you see me over there, I'm on the front line. Something chunky hanging out my Louis belt. Clutching at the wrong time and get your ass pelt. On the dead homie yeah, pool, like. Show in the section. Yeah, it's the section, like. On the hood, like. You feel me? Shit, this gate was never right here, fool. Oh, God. Gate on the block, you know what I'm saying? Wish you should stay in this house, we can get our sacks from in the morning. Man, let's do that. Big house, right? Big house, right? Big right here. Dead homie pulls up. Block, man. Dead homie pulls up. Block. We're in the motherfucking section, in the section. You know what I'm saying? Jackson Street. You know what I'm saying? On the motherfucking section, man. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, this block right here, man. That's our section right here, man. Dead homies. You know what I'm saying?